if people were given the opportunity to go back in time, I'm sure a lot of them would choose the 1920s. Uh, but unfortunately, we don't have a time machine available. I guess the next best thing might be to uh, check out the silent movies from that period. However, nearly three quarters of all original silent movie reels have long since crumbled away or were thrown away as new technologies came along. Fortunately, I have the largest collection of YouTube videos of artists' impressions and photographs of the greatest 1920s movie stars featured on original trade cards. These weren't just actors. They were role models. They were what people aspired to be. So is it any coincidence that the birth of modern fashion just happens to coincide perfectly with the rise of the 1920s movie idol? Does this actress on this original 1916 trade card remind you of anyone? Like Lady Mary from Downton Abbey by any chance, played by the beautiful Michelle Dockery? Does that mean she's been doing some time travelling? Or perhaps she has a double? Or does it simply mean that the costume designer and stylist used early 20th century ephemera like these original trade cards for inspiration for Lady Mary's look? Don't take my word for it. Let's hear it straight from the horse's mouth from a talented costume designer of another up-and-coming period drama, Mr. Selfridge. You were allowed to research and look at as much as we thought was relevant to what we were doing and then I put endless books on various websites and found as many photographs as I could. When Tutankhamun's tomb was opened in the roaring 20s it inspired a global fashion trend as women raced out to wear glitzy sequins on the jazz age dance floor. So maybe fashions do go in cycles after all and sometimes can even be resurrected from ancient glittering civilizations thousands of years old, like a scientist cloning a long extinct beast. Of course it's easier, easier to be inspired by humble ephemera like these trade cards rather than DNA, DNA cloning. Maybe we are the Indiana Joneses of the new information age. If you're a film buff, budding film director, costume or fashion designer, or like me, you're just fond of vintage styles, you might want to check out my other videos of the most fashionable 1920s movie idols featured on original trade cards. Thanks for watching.